All right, you guys, welcome back to the channel. So basically in today's video, I figured I would show you guys my settings. Uh, I've been requested this video for, um, I don't know, a few months now. Uh, a few months ago, someone did ask me if I would make this video. And uh, I said I would, but I never really did. And then um, a few videos ago, actually, someone did ask if um, I would make this video. And I did agree to it because um, I completely forgot to actually make the video a while back. But anyways, yeah, I did um, update my settings um, just a little bit uh, from a few months ago. So um, I usually play on like uh, Builder Pro. I don't really play on anything other than that. I know people have their own like custom controls. And um, trust me, these controls are um, liable to actually change because, I don't know, there's a few things I'm not happy with, like, about my builds. Like, my 90s used to be, like, so much nicer and smoother and cleaner. Now they're just a bit messed up. Like, I'm gonna try it right now. Like, see, it's a bit choppy. I don't know. I feel like it's weird. Uh, and sometimes, like, my edits don't, like, go completely through. I'm just a bit uncomfortable. Uh, but yeah, recently I've just been, um, you know, not doing too hot, so uh, I do want to improve on some things. So yeah, again, these um, these settings are liable to change, so uh, I might as well just get into it now. But uh, basically, if I go to my settings, alright, here we go. So um, I just keep matchmaking on auto. I don't really feel a need to change it because I'm just not one of those players that's like, oh my god, if I go into this, you know, matchmaking region... I'll have like the best internet there is or if I go into this um, region I'll have like you know all the trash cans in one lobby and I'll get all the wins and you know I just really don't care for that stuff I just keep it on auto I find it's the easiest um, but basically my uh, controller sensitivity X and Y I keep them the same I do feel like it's a bit like I don't know low at the moment I might raise it but yeah I just keep them at uh, 0.695 um, both of these because I don't know it's just what I'm comfortable with but yeah I probably will change these two uh, targeting sensitivity it's uh, 0 0.240 I find that it's okay it's a little bit like slightly fast at times um, if someone's like long distance but uh, for like I don't know mid-range it's perfect for me I find it's okay uh, but yeah I might lower it just a tad bit but uh, yeah for me it's okay uh, scope sensitivity uh, this one I don't really like mess around with a whole lot. Um, I only usually use um, the heavy sniper, uh, the only weapon that I use that actually has a scope on it. So uh, I find that 0.601 is okay. Like, I don't know, I haven't really messed with this one a whole lot. I just keep it at that. So uh, yeah, I find that's okay for uh, sniping. Um, but other snipers I don't really use a whole lot, like the suppressed, I don't really care for it. I miss the old bolt, I don't know, it just feels a bit weirder. Uh, if that makes sense, or a bit more weird, but, um, the hunting rifle, I don't really care for either, but, uh, yeah, that's whatever, uh, the building sensitivity, this will probably change, uh, because if I am changing the X and Y, I might as well change this, uh, because that would only make sense, but, yeah, I only have it at 1.109, just slightly above halfway, I don't know, I, I feel like it's okay where it is, I haven't really felt a need to change it, because, I don't know, it's just what I'm comfortable with. Uh, invert view, I do have this off. I don't really care for these two. Uh, invert aircraft controls, I don't really have this off. I just, I don't know, I keep it on. Uh, basically, it's default mode, but... Uh, anyways, anonymous mode, I do have it off. I don't really care if my name is hidden or not. I just, I have it off. Uh, hide other player names, I have this off. Uh, hidden matchmaking delay, I'm pretty sure these um, only really apply to like streaming and all that. Um, but yeah, I don't really stream, so I don't really, you know, have to have this on. Uh, set the scale of the HUD, I just have 1.0, I don't really know what this does. But uh, show spectator count, I do like having this on just to see, like, if people are watching me. I don't know, I get curious. I would feel weird if it was off and, like, someone was still watching me. I don't know, I like to know how many people are watching, so I do have that on. Uh, sprint by default, I'm gonna go ahead and move down. Uh, I have this off. Basically what this means is if I do move my left controller analog stick forward, um, I'll just instantly sprint. I don't have to push it down like, like that. I don't know if you guys could hear that, but yeah, it means I don't have to push that and I'll just instantly start running. But um, I don't know. I feel weird if it is on. It's just not normal. Uh, again, I've been playing like since day one. Um, well, not day one, but I've been playing Fortnite for like a long time, like since it came out, um, somewhere around that, 
time period so a lot of this stuff i just feel uncomfortable if it is on because there is stuff that is new since then so uh, i just keep some of it off uh sprint councils reload i have this off because one it's annoying and two if i like sprint while reloading i don't know it's just i don't want it to not reload so then i get in a gunfight and then i realize oh yeah my gun's not loaded because i decided to run for like three seconds i don't know i just keep it off uh tap to search interact I have this off because I like to hold it down. I really don't. I don't know. I might change that. Um, again, a lot of these could change. But yeah, for the moment, I have it off. Uh, toggle targeting. Basically, what this means, I have it off. Uh, but what it means if is if I put it on like to where I want to aim, if I just push the aim button and then like let go of it, it'll stay aiming. And then if I push it again and then release it, it'll stop aiming. So... I don't know, it's just toggle targeting. I keep it off. I don't really, you know, use it on. It feels weird, but uh, yeah, it's just whatever. I keep it off. Uh, reset building choice. I'm going to have this on because, like, if I run out of wood, um, or no, 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 this is, no, this is completely different. Uh, reset building choice. This is where if I build, like, pyramids or something, and then, like, I go to shoot my shotgun and then switch back to the builds, it won't build the, um, pyramid it'll go back to the wall so it essentially resets the building and uh yeah i have it on because i don't want to be building pyramids whenever i should be building walls but yeah that's there aim assist a lot of pc players are very controversial about this and uh i keep it on because you know i can't aim if it's you know not on it's just easier to aim with and um a lot smoother People on um, PC have it so much easier because they have all these buttons and they have insane accuracy with a uh, mouse. So, you know, it's easier for us console players to have it on. But anyways, edit mode aim assist. I have this off because, good God, it is annoying. If I go to, like, edit, um, I don't know, it just kind of drags my edits everywhere and I hate that. So I keep it off. Uh, turbo building, I do have this on because I want to build as fast as I can and not just constantly be pushing the button to build. But, uh, turbo delete in creative mode, I have this on, I, I don't really know what it does. Uh, auto material change, this is where, like, say you're building walls and you run out of wood, it will instantly switch to, like, brick or metal, uh, whatever other material you have. So, uh, basically if I had this off and I ran out of wood, I would have to switch to brick and then start building. So, with this, it just automatically changes if I do run out. So, um, a nice little feature that I've always kept on. Uh, controller auto run. I have this off because I feel like it's been really annoying. Like, sometimes I'll accidentally activate it and, um, whenever I don't really mean to. And, um, I don't really feel like it's very helpful to me. A lot of people do like it, but me personally, I just keep it off. Um, allow cross-platform parties. I do have players on Xbox, um, that I actually play with. Uh, some friends of mine. So, I do have it on as well as PC. Um, auto open doors, I might turn this on as well as auto pick up weapons, but for now I have them off. Uh, auto sort consumables to write. This one someone actually mentioned to me in the comments of uh, one of my videos because I used to have this off. I had no idea this was a feature, but basically if I pick up a med kit, it would put it in my like first slot whenever I would always switch it to my um, last one, my fifth slot. So uh, someone in the comments actually said, hey, you know, you can turn it on to where your consumables go straight to the last slot and i had no idea so thank you for that if you're watching this uh builder pro i have build immediately on because i just like to build immediately like uh basically if i build a wall and then a ramp it'll basically preview the ramp first and then i would have to build so uh, this kind of prevents the preview and um whenever this came out i hated it because so many other players were already used to it and I was not and I was building way too slow and everyone was building so fast and uh, I decided you know what I'm gonna put it on I'm gonna get used to it and uh, yeah I basically got used to it now I can't play without it uh, controller edit hold time I have this at 0 0.100 um, basically I like to edit you know as quick as possible so that's why that's there vibration I have this on a lot of people say they have to play with it off but for me, I have to play with it on. I think my brother actually plays with it off. I'm not too sure, but I have to have it on. It just feels weird if it's not. Uh, record replays. Um, I do have this on just in case, you know, um, there's 
uh, two people in solos teaming, I could go back and check and see if they actually are. So uh, I have used it and I have seen some solos actually teaming. So, you know, I do keep it on. And these two I just keep off. I don't really, you know, care for these. Uh, but anyways, my brightness is 50. Um, I just like it halfway. I think it's fine that way. Uh, music volume, I do have it at 0 0.08. You know, just kind of background uh, music. I don't really, you know, want it blaring in my ears. But uh, sound effects volume, uh, 0 0.35. I just, I don't know. I find that, you know, it's okay there. Voice chat volume, I do have it all the way up. Mainly because uh, my friends on Xbox, I feel like their voice is a bit quieter than um, like PlayStation uh, friends of mine that like if we want to use voice chat, I don't know. Theirs is a bit more quieter and uh, PlayStation, if I'm not in a party, it's fine. So I don't really care for it. But yeah, I do keep that a bit up. Uh, cinematics volume, this isn't really going to matter because like, I don't know if it's a new season, then obviously it does matter because you're going to have that little cinematic and you do want to hear stuff. So I just keep it at 50. Subtitles, again, this is basically just for um, the cinematics. Uh, but yeah, you don't really use this a whole lot. Voice chat, I do have on for, you know, in case I want to play with Xbox players. Obviously, I can't get in a party like on PlayStation and Xbox. So I do have it on because I have to go into voice chat. Uh, all this colorblind stuff, I haven't really messed with. Um, this is for like a keyboard. And all of these are my combat controls. Again, I only play Builder Pro. I don't have any custom stuff. I did mess with it for a bit, but I just decided to go back to Builder Pro because it's what I was comfortable with, and I still am. Uh, this stuff I haven't really messed with. I might mess with it um, later on, but I probably will make an updated uh, video on all of this stuff because uh, I do want to change a few things around and uh, get like a custom controller maybe. Um, I don't know, but yeah, this is basically all my settings. Uh, this is all my HUD stuff. Everything's just on, so, you know, there's all that. Um, I'm gonna put don't save, but... Anyways, yeah, those are my settings, and... As far as my builds go... Like, I can't really say they're the best, so I am trying to improve on them just a little bit. But, uh, yeah, those are basically my settings. And, um, another thing I did want to talk to you guys about... Uh, I might have already mentioned it, but uh, basically my internet has been like really bad recently. So um, I'm trying to get that fixed. Basically, I can't go into solos without like lagging every maybe 10 minutes, every 5 minutes maybe. So I've been trying to work with that. Um, I don't know. I might not be able to upload till maybe Monday. So that's a big issue that I got to fix. So uh, I'm sorry for any inconvenience, but... I figured the timing is perfect. I could just make this video because people have wanted to see it. So yeah, those are basically my settings. And you know, one last time, they will probably change soon. But uh, yeah, for now, I just basically rock uh, Builder Pro. I feel like it's the easiest. And uh, yeah, I'm gonna go for a 90 actually real quick and see how good I do. Right, here we go. Yeah, see, like it's okay, but like, I can definitely improve, like, I'm gonna go at it again. Watch me do horrible. Yeah, see, like, I don't know. It just feels a bit weird at the moment, but... I'm gonna go again. Yeah, see, I don't know. And then, like, sometimes my floors will build out here. Like, I don't know what it is, but, um... Yeah, I don't know. I've been practicing, like, a lot. As well as, like, some pyramids. Like, doing that. Like, I used to do all of this type of stuff, but I feel like I kind of, like, gave up on it. I don't know why. Uh, I guess because, like, some of it isn't really necessary, but then again, a lot of it really is. So, uh, yeah, I'm just basically going to be practicing a lot of that. So, uh, but yeah, anyways, hopefully you guys did find this video helpful. I'm sorry if it was, like, really long and boring, but yeah, those are basically my settings. And, uh, yeah, again, I do hope they helped. But, um, yeah, that was basically the end of the video, so, um, I don't know. It's a decent, like, configuration, my controls and all that, so. Anyways, yeah, hopefully you guys did enjoy this video, and I'll see you guys in the next video, man. Bye.